remove the two screws on the upper side of the fuser unit. Remove the cover. Detach the spring. Remove the black plastic lever. Remove the metal plate. On the other side, detach the spring. Remove the other plastic lever, and the other metal plate. Remove the fuser roller sleeve. Remove the lower fuser roller. If the lower roller is not worn, you can clean it with a dedicated cleaner, or with isopropyl alcohol. Check if the bushings are too worn. These are paper path sensors. Remove the side plastic part. It's hold in place with two hooks. Slide the old fuser sleeve. This is the heating element. Reinstall the lower fuser roller. Insert the new fuser sleeve. For more information on how to install a fuser sleeve, in the description you will find a link to a video. Reinstall the side plastic part. Install the fuser sleeve. Reinstall the metal plate, black lever, and spring. On the other side of the fuser unit, reinstall metal plate, lever, and spring. Install the upper cover. Reinstall the two screws. And the work is done.